How are you? Uh, tired, but better. Something's wrong. How are you? I'm fine. You forget I know lying. It's a long story. It's not really worth getting into right now, especially when I have a surprise for you. Look what Henry found. You did it. That's right. Now, what do you say we let out the author? I have some questions. Emma, please, think about this. This isn't just what Regina wanted. This is what Gold wanted, too. He was doing it to turn you dark. I'm not worried about it, are you? Because now I have some questions about me. And he can tell us everything. If he's the one who wrote your story. What are you talking about? Something you need to know about this author. He wasn't the only one. There have been many authors throughout time. It's a job, not a person. And the one trapped in here was just the last tasked with the great responsibility. Which is? To record. To witness the greatest stories of all time and record them for posterity. The job has gone back eons. From the man who watched shadows dance across cave walls and develop an entire philosophy. To playwrights who tell tales and poetry. To a man named Walt. Many have had this sacred job. Great women and men who took on the responsibility with the gravity that it deserved. Until this last one. He started to manipulate rather than record. He did something, I don't know exactly what, but something that pushed them over the edge. How dare you? How dare you force me to do that to that child? Makes for a better story. Return the quill. You are ill-suited for this job. You have abused all the rules. You have lied. You have deceived us. You have forsaken your holy duty. And now, you must be punished. That's why the sorcerer and his apprentice put him in there.